Let me get ready for battle. Prepare for battle. Right now. Here you are standing at the top of the mountain. Congratulations. The only question is, do you have what it takes to do it again next year? But before we answer that, let's take one last look at your personal fantasy flashback from this season. You just never thought that I would get this far. Never thought it would happen this soon. But here we are, people. Now, some of you may know. I have won in the fifth season. A fantasy football league. 2023-2024 league. So. With that being said. Congratulate me. Or, you know, you can do what many people have done. You know, in the previous seasons. Kind of counted me out, said I don't know much about football, said I'm not really football savvy, you know. But humbly, despite of, I was a student of the game. And I took all the criticism and I learned. I learned. And here we are. What can I say, people? It was a hell of a season. You saw the video. Great season thus far. I learned from my mistakes in the previous season last year. I traded A.J. Brown. Ironically, the person I traded him to, he ended up winning that season. And shout out to him. He came in and dominated. Fucking dominated that season. So, um, yeah, people. The thing about it is, you know, I honestly... Probably potentially doubted myself for a minute. However, I did not quit. I did not quit. And uh, probably the last person you expected to actually win a championship belt. As y'all can see here. Oh, yeah. Bulls logo. And my name on it. By the way. <laughs> So, with that being said, let's do a recap on the drop.
first pick, as I said before, I've learned from my mistakes. My first pick was uh, none other than A.J. Brown. First pick out the gate, A.J. Brown. I believe my second pick was C.D. Lamb, which we all know he definitely helped in this season. But I have to give it to the glass cannon himself. Before the season even started, I traded Debo Samuel, which I believe Debo was probably my fourth, fifth pick for Christian McCaffrey. Shout out to Christian McCaffrey, man. You definitely got me to that championship. Unfortunately, I couldn't use you in the first and second rounds, whatever. But as we can see, didn't need him. I did not need him, people. Uh, so, yeah. Chris McCaffrey came in, absolutely dominated. Now, what's crazy is A.J. Brown, during the championship round, his first pass, he got injured. His very first pass. And honestly, people, I thought I was absolutely done for. However, Tyreek Hill, who was drafted by Mr. Washington Tugboat, he could tugboat his ass to lose the land because I won. I won. By two points. Unbelievably, I won by two points, people. As y'all saw in the video. Two points. Anything can happen in football, people. Absolutely anything. Um, To the people who haven't won, take it from me. Keep playing. It's been literally a new winner every season we played. And... It's a learning curve. It's a learning experience. I can honestly say and admit I've learned from the best. They know who they are, you know. So, yeah, people. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, with that, I'll leave you guys with this. With that pick, I won a championship. I won a championship. So, with that being said, people, and to the Hokage League, good luck to y'all next season because you're going to need it. Hell, I'm going to need it. I'm probably going to end up drafting last. But, Keep this in mind. Quit is never win. Win is never quit. Until next season, people. Peace.